to the big news that I've been wanting to share with you is being edited today. And, um, uh oh, it might be revealed. Can you see this? Can you see what's going on here? This is my baby. This is my baby girl. She's not a lap kitty quite yet. Um, so that was a total spoiler. I signed up to foster kitties and I got a cat that um, is borderline. If, if the cats are young, they can train them a little bit and um, spay, neuter, and adopt them out. But when the cats are older, they just release them back into the wild. So they spay, neuter, bob their ear so you can tell that they've been fixed and release them. This special kitty, I don't know a lot about her. She came with um, the name Taboo and she needs a new name, obviously. But um, she is six months old, more or less. And that's really borderline. Um, she has super wild ways, like, like she's like a little panther in the house. But she is the most loving, amazing kitty I've, I've ever been exposed to. So brave and so trusting. Um, I can just maul her, like nose in her belly fluff and wiggle back and forth and kiss her and smooch her and, but only in her bed. <laughs> so she's, we've got this like safe zone where we can, we can play and love each other. And I can pet her while she's eating and a little bit on the floor, but she does not like to be in the open because she was feral just a short time ago. I've got amazing feet. Yes, you have a good purr. Purr it. Look at my little toes. They're the best toes ever. I got the best toes ever. I like them rubbed in between like this. Feels so good. Oh, feels so good. Look at this baby. Oh, rummy, rummy, rummy. Oh, rummy, rummy. Pet me any which way. I don't even care. I love having a kitty in the house. Unfortunately, um, I had cats growing up, but then somewhere along the line, I, I became allergic to them and I thought it was okay. Um, the first like 10 days she was here, I didn't have any symptoms at all. I'm like, oh, I got over that. Um, but once we started snuggle training, then, <laughs> then that was a little too much for my immune system. So I'm a little poofy in the cheat. Having a kitty on my, on my desk is pretty amazing. I love her. I love you. I love you. She needs a new name. So nobody is better at picking animal names than the collective, you guys. So put your best name below and you'll be featured in a future video. So I've got a few things that I've been thinking of that are coming down the wire, coming down the pipe, whatever that saying is. Um, so the, the vlogs, I love doing them, it was super fun, but it was also really weird for me to film my normal everyday life. Those YouTubers that can do that, hats off. Um, I don't have public fear of filming. I, I'm kind of a shameless human being, which is good or bad, but um, it was just, it was just trying to capture everything and not being present in the moment. And my whole life's practice has been to be present in the moment. So when I'm with friends, I'm with friends. I'm not filming. Um, and that just felt weird. It felt a little too invasive for even the likes of me. So, but I don't want to end it, but I think it's kind of weird to have a random vlog every once in a while. So I have a better idea. What if we do, not every week, but maybe every week, I do a week in review. Are you guys interested? Would you like to see that? Just a recap of the random footage that I take, because I, I take a lot of footage that I end up erasing at the end of the month. So all of that weird stuff, things that I'm doing, things I'm making, experiences we're having, like little snippets that aren't video worthy. They're not something I'm gonna make a whole video on, but um, just little captures, sneak peeks. We can review. Are you interested? Do you want to see that? Leave me a comment below. And um, maybe I'll just do it in this video. Yeah, here, I'll give you an example.
do that to me. I scared the poop out of them. <laughs> Let him walk back. <laughs> he didn't like that at all, Glenn. I don't like that at all. You ready? Go, Sanders, go, 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 Sanders, go. Go, 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 go. Go, go Sanders. Go. Go. Go, Sanders. Go. Nope. Oh, it's too cold. Too cold. <laughs> the snowcock. Somebody's getting a new toy. I'll give you a hint. It's not one of these. And it's not one of these either. Can you guess? I'll just take it for the sales deal. I'm just sticking it to it out. Okay. I'll take over from here. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Beholding the glory. <clears throat> okay. My lovely is 
assistant ready? Yes. It's actually already got some break to it, so this is just gonna be just making it a little firmer. Topping it off. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. You got your stuff there standing by? Standing by. Okay, I can see some coming through. Okay, boring. Do you notice it going down at all? Mm, yeah, imperceptibly. Super good, but. A little? Not like it's great, but it's better than it was. This is Glenn's new janky toy. Five hour conversion. Is it five hours? It was actually 15, but it says three in the manual. <laughs> it's a snow bike. I think the dudes are going to love this one. Hi, my baby. Hi, my baby. You said, says, I'm not getting off. I'm not getting off. No. Hi, Lucy. Look what I brought for you. Some warm cords. Warm cords. Yum. So tasty. So tasty. Booty Sanders. You're missing out. <laughs> he won't get off the chicken eater. I just walked right up to him and kissed him and he was like, it didn't even budge. He's like, I love this thing. <laughs> He's a little mess. Pretty seeing this bird, you're missing out. Some warm porridge. We have a visitor to the chicken coop. There's a, there's a little quail in here. And the girls have been, they've been shut in since yesterday. So it's been in here a while. I'm gonna try to catch it. Hi baby. Hi baby. Oh, 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 we landed on my head. <laughs> He landed on my head, lovey. Hi, baby. Come on. I'm going to help you get out of here. I'm going to help you get out of here. I'm going to help you get out of here. Okay, I don't think I'm helping anybody. Oh, we have eggs. They got some food. They laid us some eggs. It's not, it doesn't want to get out. It could, it would easily fly out the door if it wanted to. I would to. think so. Come here. <laughs> we have, um, we have tres huevos. Oh, wow. I know. Does that count to take one? No. Don't do that to me. It's going to poop out of them. <laughs> let him walk back. <laughs> like that at all, Glenn. I don't like that at all. You ready? Go, Sanders. Go, 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 Sanders. Go. Go, 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 go. Go. Go, Sanders. Go. Let's 
Go at the end. Go. No, oh, it's too cold. It's too cold. The snow gone. Got the town, the gorge, the moon. So what do you think of that? Want to see more? Let me know in the comments below. And um, also, YouTube has made a couple changes that I want to alert you guys to. Um, if you're not getting notifications on my homepage, you'll see a little bell. Click that and you can choose your notification preferences. And also, the end cards, as, as of the last maybe couple months, there's a new end card that I've been rolling out and it gives you um, my avatar, the Apple my hand with the apple and you can click on that and subscribe at the end of every video it also gives you two videos sometimes I choose the videos and sometimes I allow uh, YouTube to choose the videos for you so if there's a video that's pertinent to the video that I've played it will be there so that will make it easy for you like if I talk about a fudge video and a non fudge video like I'll put the fudge video at the end so that just makes it a little more fluid and you know at the end of the video if I've referenced another video it most likely will be there. And um, also, I, for those of you that have followed the channel for a long time, a couple years, I've traditionally ended all my videos with the end card, Be Love. It's cold outside and hot in here. And I missed that, and the reason that I did that was for me, it was to remind me that this is my mission, this is my purpose, this is my um, behavioral guiding star, if you will. And I kind of miss that, but because the way the end cards now work, um, I have about you know 18 to 20 seconds slotted at the end of the video that um, needs to be needs to look a certain way so that I can I can annotate it on YouTube. But I miss that be love slogan. So I've been trying to think of a way that I could incorporate it into my video as my personal reminder every time, but also as um, a message because it's really important to constantly have these affirmations um, in our lives, whatever they are, that that guide us. These little these little small clues as to the bigger picture and prayer is that for many of you and myself included um, but I also like to have just the visual reminder so I'm thinking be love and I was kind of playing around with the words a little bit be loved be loved ed beloved and that as soon as that came together for me, I was like, yes, you are my beloved. So now instead of beloved, it is beloved because we are all here together as part of a community. So um, I'm just going to start addressing you guys now as my beloved. And you'll see that in future videos. When I say that, I'm not talking about my invisible friends here. I'm talking about you. 
So thank you for being here. I truly um, love making these videos and I love this community that we've built and I love that you are a part of it and I love that you've shared yourself so generous with me um, in response to my sharing with you. And yeah, thank you. I'm super stoked. So this week I have, um, I wanna make my molasses cookie, which is kind of like a gingerbread, but American style. They are amazing. And there's one ingredient I keep in my house that I never use for anything else except for this cookie because because um, it's vital. Because I've tried to substitute it and it's not possible. Um, so I'll make that video, what's today, Sunday? Maybe tomorrow, I think I'll sleep that video. Um, Tuesday, my BFF from, from California is back in town. They have a house here. And so, um, so I'm going skiing with her and her little chillins. And, um, and then maybe this week I'll have time for one more Christmas holiday Hanukkah um, recipe. So leave me a comment below. So you've got three things. Cat name. Um, what do you think of the weekly vlog? Not weekly vlog week in review and um, what your favorite Christmas recipe is that you would like to see me tackle or a recipe that you haven't quite found a really delicious one or something you've been struggling with or something that you'd like to see created on um, a video this week before Christmas so we have we have two food video slots I think that we have time for realistically and that's it my beloveds, see you in the next video.